Ladies and gentlemen, and all crew members, thank you for coming. 
to Nagasaki. I wish all of you a safety journey and have a wonderful voyage. This is my dad would now like to present Captain Anna Yutun with the plug of Nagasaki board.
entered your domain with vile polywogs on board who acknowledge not your way. Fish! Mr. Fish!
safety when stepping from the tender onto the platform let the crew assist you and follow their instructions
John F. Kennedy, a Navy veteran of World War II and a Purple Heart recipient, once said, as we express our gratitude, we must never forget that the highest appreciation is not to utter words, but to live by them. To be examples as grateful patriots for those that secured our freedoms and allowed us to live in the manner we choose without question. To honor those that have died, no matter the cause, in a just and honorable way. Old soldiers do die, often in combat, and so do young soldiers and sailors and Marines and airmen, service members, young and old, men and women, from every branch of every military service, every country, die defending their country and their way of life. They fought in popular and unpopular wars in countries all over the world. They carried their country's flag and the ideas and values for which it stands to every corner of the world. They didn't go for glory or honor or fame. They went because their country, represented by their people, including you and I, asked them to place themselves in harm's way. They sacrificed family, friends, and their lives to serve their country. The New Testament tells us that there is no greater love than to give your life for another. Our fallen comrades have demonstrated that love, and that is what our remembrance is. <laughs>